Ukraine's opposition leader and top diplomat are rarely in the same room, but at a panel discussion in Munich, Leonid Kozhara and Vitaly Klitschko shared a stage and a few sharp exchanges. Are you with the extremists who are attacking the police with Molotov cocktails or not? If you are leading the opposition, please be also responsible. Klitschko said the government of President Viktor Yanukovych had chosen to escalate the crisis. He hoped cooler heads would prevail. We are all looking at our country, Ukraine, one of Europe's largest countries, as European, modern, stable in its economy and its politics. We would like to lower the temperature. The standoff in Ukraine began two months ago, when the government decided to forego a deal with the EU and join a trade pact with Russia. The US Secretary of State alluded to that move. That means their futures do not have to lie with one country alone and certainly not coerced. The United States and the EU stand with the people of Ukraine in that fight. Russia, for its part, accused the West of bias toward the opposition. Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov said Western governments should also condemn opposition excesses. Why don't we condemn those who seize and hold government buildings, attack the police and use racist, anti-Semitic and Nazi slogans? At a protest in Munich earlier in the day by exiled Ukrainians, Klitschko told demonstrators he was confident the opposition would eventually succeed.